The problem with dating these days is that there are so many rituals that people have to go through before they can establish that they are in a relationship. You may think that you and that girl are technically an item, but she might not be on the same page. Just because you made the effort to pursue a girl does not mean that you've got the relationship in the back. Sometimes, a girl can't make up her mind or is just too nice to tell you point blank that she has no intention of going out with you anymore. Learning to let go is not easy. But here are some signs which will probably tell you that it's time to move on because the person you are holding onto might not be into you or worse still, is a parasite on your soul. 1. She is not your type. The earlier you realize it, the easier it is for you. If you do not share any interests, or do not partake in activities that either of you enjoys then you are doomed. Her preferences might depend on her upbringing and social environment, so do not be judgmental about her choices. 2. You are rebound. Being with you is just an escape for her from her past. If you are in such a situation then it's a dead end and it's clearly time to move on. Hanging on to a loose thread is not a decision many wise men would make. 3. You are just her muse. Maybe she is bored with life and decided to stick with you just for fun's sake. In such a scenario, you should be worried because you will never mean anything to her and may just end up fulfilling her social needs. 4. She is too nice to say no to you. She is a nice girl and is very generous and kind. And it's a problem because you know that she will probably not know how to say no. She keeps pushing you away but not hard enough and you be left hanging because it's not going to work that way. Some people just don't know how to handle a situation when a guy confesses his liking or love for them. She might initially seem interested and even flirt with you a little, but in your heart, you will know if she is not into you. She will not be there like you are, not wholeheartedly for sure. You will be able to sense that she is distant even if her words say otherwise. She might be too nice to say no or maybe a little confused about whether you'd be good for her, but you should be smart enough to understand it. Will you want someone half-hearted if you feel so intensely? No, right. That right there is your answer to when should a sincere man stop pursuing a girl. This is a tricky one because while she may not be into you, she will not brush you off either. Plus she has no current relationship. Be smart, read between the lines, and know when you should stop pursuing her. 5. Her phone is more important than you are. When to stop pursuing a girl. To find the answer, pay attention to where you rank on her priority list. She says you are her friend but when out with you she doesn't leave her phone down at all. She answers all the calls, checks every forwarded message and maybe even makes unimportant calls just because. She doesn't give you the basic attention even that a friend would deserve. If you try calling her in the evening or after work hours, her phone would always busy. It could be because she is talking to someone she is interested in. You could just be a backup for her if things turn sour with the guy she likes. 6. She is still getting over a breakup. It takes longer for some people to get over a breakup, even if the past relationship was a short one. Such people are still battling their emotions and are not ready to get into another relationship. They also carry baggage that perhaps needs processing, and they are hence lying low. If she is not yet ready for a romantic relationship and you keep sending her signals she may find you insensitive, even if she likes the attention. She will definitely not think of you in any romantic way if she is not over her past boyfriend. It is best to leave her alone as she may feel frustration or guilt over not being able to move on and always think of you as a part of her dark day. You should know when to stop trying with a girl and move on. 7. She breadcrumbs you. When someone breadcrumbs another person, they give them just enough attention to make them think that they like them. But that's all it is, crumbs. It's nothing really. They just want to keep you around for their own amusement when they feel like it. 8. It's not going anywhere. You have confessed your feelings to her, but she hasn't given you any reaction. You ask her about it but she finds a way to neither say yes nor no. Your friendship is at a standstill. You don't know whether your relationship with her is moving forward or backward. It doesn't seem negative or is there anything concrete. You are making yourself insane, trying to figure out what's wrong with your conversations or what's right. The only constant in this equation is a sense of confusion. Ask yourself, is it worth chasing a girl when you don't even know where you stand with her? And this not knowing can kill you from inside. But if you feel that the relationship is not going anywhere and it has been a while, you should stop pursuing the girl. 9. She creates an emotional barrier. She avoids any conversation where there is a chance of the two of you talking about a deep relationship. What are her fears? What does she want from life? What are her expectations and her biggest weaknesses? What are yours? Topics that involve her personal life or conflicts will be off limits, nor will she ask you questions to know you intimately. Take it as a sign that she wants to keep you away from her personal space and life because she doesn't want you to be a part of it. This is an absolute sign she wants you to leave her alone. Take the cue and stop chasing her. Stay friends if you want, but leave it there. 10. She sounds uninterested. Indifference is one of the reactions that are easy to decipher. A person who is unenthusiastic is easily recognizable. 
Her glassy eyes, monotone voice, and general appearance of boredom are definite signs that she is not interested. She's also probably not rejecting you because she thinks it's too much work, so stop pursuing the girl. 11. She never initiates anything. Maybe you don't notice it at first because you're blinded by love or lust, but after a while, you start to realize that she never initiates texts, calls, or sees you. Sometimes you feel like if you didn't reach out first, you may never hear from her again. 12. She ghosts you. If you notice that you're the only one who initiates anything, maybe you have backed off a bit, and then it's crickets, complete silence from her end, or perhaps she just unexpectedly stopped responding to any of your attempts to reach out. She totally disappeared, even if it was for a short time. This is a huge sign that you should stop pursuing the girl. 13. She talks about other guys. Similar to wanting to set you up with another girl, she also talks about other guys with you. This is her indirect way of telling you that she has friends owned you. She's telling you that she is much more interested in these guys than she is in you. 14. She blows hot and cold. This might confuse you because sometimes she seems really into you, and then other times she's very uninterested. She might just like the attention from you when she is blowing hot. And if she's blowing cold, then maybe she is getting attention from other guys and is annoyed by you at the moment. How to know if she likes you but is hiding her feelings from you. With that being said, you shouldn't wait around for someone to figure out if they want to be with you or not. Instead, you need to be proactive and see if she has feelings for you. You can always ask her without figuring out if she likes you, but, of course, it's easier said than done. Everyone gets a fear of rejection. And if you're a shy individual, this may not be the best approach. Don't worry. What you can do is make sure she likes you before asking. Just pay attention to the signs she likes you but is hiding her feelings for you. Then, when you're done assessing, it's time to make your move.